some stunning pictures now of how a mountain rescue team has actually dealt with this problem on our behalf. Early morning and Calder Valley search and rescue team have already been scrambled. OK, so we're just on our way up um, to a couple of vehicles which are stuck in the snow, up right on the tops of one of these um, Pennine roads. This road's only passable by four-wheel drive and it's very, very cold up here and uh, these guys look to be in a, in a bit of bother, so we're going to go and uh, see if we can help them out. So. And this is what a bit of bother looks like, 1,200 feet up. Five vehicles and their drivers are stranded in extreme weather conditions. Uh, we'll get you out. OK, we've got another Land Rover coming in from the other side. Right, we just, uh, what are you going to do, pull me through? No, we'll just let you be leaving your car here for the time being. Weather conditions in Yorkshire rarely get any more extreme than this. We're at the top of the Pennines between the villages of Littleborough and Rippenden. It's minus five degrees up here, or minus 15 with the wind chill. And if you look behind me, this, a few hours ago, was a road. But after hours of heavy snowfall, it's now impossible to tell where the road ends and the nearby reservoir begins. It's a dangerous situation and the rescue team need to act quickly. So we can get this reverse back down. This one's broken down, yeah. get this shifted to the side. Then the guy in the Discovery can get out. That Jag's not going anywhere. Right. While some cars are consigned to a wintry grave, emergency work gets underway to shift those that still have a chance of escape. It's a long, cold wait for the stranded drivers who've had to learn the hard way about travelling through snow. Lots of good Samaritans arrived and we all started digging and unfortunately some of us have broken down and now some of us are stuck. Uh, the snow's blowing over the road so as fast as we dig it, it's blowing back in again. And it's certainly time to get off the moor as soon as we possibly can. You can see behind me now just the difference that snow chains on a Land Rover can make. It's the difference between being stranded at the top of the Pennines in minus 15 degrees and making it out in one piece. We've just had to um, pull two vehicles out. We're still slipping and sliding. Um, and it, it, it's just unbelievable that anybody's um, got up here and tried to carry on through this, you know. So the message loud and clear, if in doubt, don't go out. Nicola Rees, BBC Look North, Calderdale. I think, Nicola, those uh, pictures tell an incredible story.